Alfred? Here I come, buddy. Heading into the basement. Be careful. God, there's always some bullshit happening in the basement, bro. Either scary shit- Ooh! 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 I told you, there's always something happening in the basement, man. I'm alright. Oh my god, bro. She thought she was slick putting that gun underneath the stairs. There's no one here. No Alfred. Damn it! There's blood on the walls. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to see too. what I can find. Standing by. Can't believe they did my Alfred dirty like that, bro. Like he had nothing to do with this. This is where they had Alfred. Where they beat him. Mm, he's pissed. I'm pissed too, especially seeing the fucking glare on this game. Like, come on. Improve your quality, Telltale Games. Alfred's blood is still fresh. Means we can't be far behind them. Up, oh, I see another splatter right here, so... No? Okay, whatever. Ooh! Blood trail. Alfred, there's a boot print in the blood. Lady Arkham's soldiers dragged him. The trail stops at the wall. Actually, it goes under it. Which means Sounds it's like a it's fake wall. Than it would appear. Yep, Taking it's a, a fake look, wall. The wall is just a facade. Why would the Veils have a false wall in their basement? Well, either way, I'm going to push. Now Jesus let's find out where the Veils were hiding. There's a small room. Damn. With a hole in the floor. Oh no, I knew it! Even more bullshit to deal ladder. with. Anyone down there would be trapped. Hmm. Alfred! Maybe he's unconscious. That's why he's not answering. Lord. I'm going inside. Without the ladder, bro? Ooh, what is this? What the hell is this? Chains? Belts? down there. Do you see Alfred? No. It's some kind of torture chamber. Shackles, belts, blood. Wow. What? Vicky, she was kept down here, locked away. Who could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. Damn. What is there to understand? To willfully hurt a child. It's why she killed the Veils. They abused her. Damn. I'm not saying what she did was right, but... But... I can't imagine what she went through. Me either. The Veils' foster shit. children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. There are drawings. Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different, newer. I guess we're onto something. Bloody scratches, fingernails. Someone tried to climb out. Alfred? No. Nah, Vicky. Vicky when she was a little kid. The belt. It's caked in blood. I am so glad I'm not in the foster care system, because I'd be hearing some crazy stories. Shackles. Blood on them. Old. And new. Vicky did to Alfred what was done to her. Damn, Vicky. Alfred laid down here. 
so he was in this hole. Disturbing. Vicky created her here, in this room. This is where Vicky Vale became Lady Arkham. Hmm, how interesting. Alfred's glasses. Okay, that's the clue he left, I guess. And the new chalk. One piece apart from the others. Purple. Mm. The same color as my tack. Can't be a coincidence. Maybe... He left a... Okay, Alfred. That drawing. Lady Arkham. Looks Arson. like Alfred. The highlighted words read, To Arkham. Hmm. So obviously this is the easiest link I've ever done. Alfred left me another clue. This is what he wanted me to find. To see. He's modified one of her own Lady Arkham drawings to include himself. And these two words, to Arkham. Then she's going to Arkham, and she's taking Alfred with her. That's the final piece, Arkham. She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems, including Arkham Asylum. She's going to open the doors, release the inmates. Oh and hell she took no! Alfred with her. We better Gordon skip that over right now. I'm on it. Lady Arkham won't be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. Damn, this is... This is where it all ends. Arkham Asylum. Question is, who's gonna be able to walk out? And where's Alfred? I swear to God, if they kill him... Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it, then. The children of Arkham have taken over. That suits no slouch. You're well prepared for a fight. And the GCPD are on their way to deal with the inmates. Good. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. What's going on? Go ahead. I got this. Hmm. Okay, so uh, I'm dealing with one... one goon. <laughs> this ends now, Vicky. Tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his paper. Answer he the does. question. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll be dead soon. Damn. Another corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. Killing him won't solve anything. But it will teach Bruce Wayne a lesson. What lesson? What he and all of Gotham will learn. What they lesson? They won't get the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from you, Vicky? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. Why? You have no idea what I've done to come this far. Too much to turn back now. I know you've suffered. You were tortured, held captive by the people who were supposed to love you. I don't know how you survived. You want to know how I survived? I survived. Because every night, I dreamed of the revenge I'd take on them. Clearly, since you're shocking the death. Forsaken city. Your time's run out. Really? Okay, bet. Because I can't move away. Oh! Oh! You got me. Okay, bet. Vicky! There's nothing you can do, Batman. You underestimate the true children of Arkham. These souls kept behind bars. Open the doors! Oh shit, I walked into a trap. And now I have to fight all of them. 
Arkham! Listen to me! Freedom is yours! The only one standing in your way is Batman. How convenient. Batman. He's got me in here! Me too. Are you scared? He's the crazy one! Alright, at least you don't want this one-two punch combo. There you go, that's what you get. Max. Hey, yo, this is like the Olympics. Having to outrun, outsmart, outpunch everyone. Nah, fam, we're not doing that. Let's get out. Really? Okay, I guess. Yeah, the entire get up. security system's offline. Every inmate's loose. The leader of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went. Damn. Uh, hey, yo, this is Spike Club. Oh my god. Oh, there she is. A little psycho. You're not getting away, Vicky. Slow motion? I didn't know Batman has this power. Alright, so... Ooh, a punch. And... Would that work? Yes, it would. Now, the next one. I guess this is the only link, right? Boom. Oh yeah, he's gonna fall right into that corner right there. He's gonna be knocked out. And honestly, I'm gonna say the chair with the inmate. Cause he's already near the table, so. Oh, hell no. We're not gonna do that. Taser, inmate. All right, let's see if this works. Ooh, link taser. Wait, wait, hold on. Table with Lady Arkham? Can I do that? Oh yeah, this should be fun. Let's go. One. her mask off. Batman, Are you serious, time, bro? Sons. That's the plan. Are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> Alright, bye bye. Two knives, bro? You really want to cut me up, huh? Not today. You should quit while you can, because I'm not even for you, bro. John Doe. Truly inspiring. Such a pleasure to see your work in person. Really? Finally, you guys came. Batman! Lady Arkham has a hostage. We've got the inmates. Lock it down! Thank God. I'm not even gonna question that. Hey. There's hey. no way out now. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. 
My pleasure. Oh, shit. He did the one, two, three combo. This sucks. How many stories did I fell through? Why am I not paralyzed? She dipped. Man, this is some crazy shit. Where am I? Vicky! Am I in the basement? <laughs> You're not well, Vicky. You need professional help. Clearly. <laughs> Says the man dressed as a bat. Let him go! The butler has to die. Payment for Thomas Wynn's sins. He took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. If you Whoa. really want to save the butler, bring me Bruce Wayne. Damn, man. If anyone really? can find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind a 12-inch thick wall and a hundred bodyguards right now. Why should I trust you'll keep your word? Because my mask is off now, Batman. I won't lie. Hmm. You're doing so there. much for one old man. Oh, Lord. I don't know what to do. Shit. Whoa! Oh, I got stabbed. And I'm dead. Okay, let me try again. You're doing so much for one old man. All right, let me do that combo again. Oh! Woo! Oh my god, Vicky, bro. stop playing games. This isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? I've done great things for Gotham. Falcone and Hill As deserved to if die. you drugged this city. Anything, I, I mean, almost. People. Drugged people. We're killed your parents. The same fight, Batman. It's kidnapping people. Can you see that? We want the same things. Girl. Those men deserved their day in court. Just like everyone else. So they could have gotten off like they did so many times before? No, Batman. They got exactly what they deserved. My justice is final and absolute. You're not the judge, jury, and executioner, be Vicky. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than this one? He hides behind his status and wealth. He's a coward, leaving other men to carry his burdens. Oh, no! Woo! I almost died. Oh, there she is. I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. She's trying to get into your head, Batman. What Goddess. about you? Do you wear the mask to hide? Or to become who you really are? Are you the man? Or the mask? The mask is a symbol. Some fear it. But for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. You too. And huh? once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. As if. Yo, it's a trap! Oh! Look at her running away. Puta. The hell am I? Is this some kind of a church that I'm in? Alfred! Shit. Hold on, Alfred. Uh, you... You... You came. Came for me. Uh, 
I would always After come for you, what buddy. What you said. I knew you'd come. The man. The man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Did you see where she went? Uh, she just... Dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Above you! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Woo! No! <laughs> Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar. Alfred. <sighs> Such concern. Yeah, For okay. someone you've never met before. It's called compassion, Vicky. Something you seem to know very little about. Sounds like deflection to me. There's more here than you're telling. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. Yo, I'm that pissed. Man. Don't you? Shut up, old man. You've seen my true self. Your turn. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you really are. Fuck it. If that's what it will take to save him. No! There you go. I'm Bruce Wayne, bitch. No, Bruce. This must be some kind of trick. Why? Why don't Bruce you believe? Wayne, he'd never be the man that is. Really? He only looks out for himself. Really? Oh, but of course. <laughs> now I understand. As Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless, just like your father did. Really? That's cute. A Vicky. true way. <laughs> There's nothing heroic about you. You're right about my father. The things he did are unforgivable. But I am trying to make up for his crimes. I wear this mask to help people. I'm not some naive socialite you can sweet talk. I know a liar when I see one. Really? Are you self projecting <laughs> Oh, my ear! <laughs> Yo, my ear! Oh, bro, bro, let's go. Woo! Yo, she took a chunk of my ear, bro. I'm pissed. Yo, this is No more lies. No more talk. The only truth left is in your death. You bullshit, bro. Okay. Woo. One, two, punch. Let's go, Batman. Let's go. Let's go. Careful. Damn, I'll bury you. Oh shit. Boom. Come on. Ooh, shit. That's a good thing. Yo, this is crazy. This is about to collapse and we're fighting. We're still fighting. Come on. Come on, Bruce. Let's go. Woo! 
Yep, try eating that punch, Sookie. Yeah, she's not down. Oh, she's not, okay. Yo! Yo! Yo, this is too much. I'm stressed out. You belong in this place, Bruce. Lost. Forgotten. Buried. And Gotham will not mourn. The sins of the great bloodline end here. No, I don't know. Okay, this is the end. Ooh. Ooh, she did not get it. Oh, Alfred, Alfred, oh lord, I gotta get him, I gotta get him. Please, come on my boy, we need to get out. Come on. What? Yo! I see your true face. I'll never trust you. Okay. Ah! Ooh, she dead dead. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please run away. I'm stressed out. Please run away. I like how they're slowly getting out the door. As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's Reign of Terror. <sighs> if the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. And my ears messed up. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. It's Selena. Selena. With everything that's been going on, I, I haven't gotten a chance to thank you for what you did. Sacrificing your identity for my safety. But uh, it was a dangerous thing to do. You could lose everything. The secrecy you've worked so hard to maintain. Gone. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. I love you, buddy. I'll do anything for you. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that. Aww. After everything that's happened. And your ear? At least there's something left of it. <laughs> Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that it does. We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. I didn't take them down alone. I had help. You, Lucius, Gordon. Yes, my squad. Selina. <sighs> my bay. And all those who gave their life fighting for Gotham. To those who helped and those we lost. The damage done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen. But experts agree that... Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. Well, this could be a first start. For you, and for this city. 
That's true. Though, Treat Alfred. in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored to call my friend. Thank you, Alfred. Aww. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. <laughs> I love this. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Honestly, I'm going Perhaps as... one is truly the mask. Bruce. Let Gordon know, Bruce Wayne will be there. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. Damn, that's a heavy Gordon. ass smoke. He is here. Commissioner Gordon. Yeah, it doesn't sound right. It will, trust Don't me. Don't worry. It will. Thank you for having me, Commissioner. What uh, happened to your ear? It looks painful. Cut myself shaving? Mm. What'd you use, a chainsaw? <laughs> yeah. To be honest, I was surprised to get you a call. Now, after that nasty business at your manor, I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. A loss like that, I wouldn't blame you for lying low. Why would I? What you did is no secret. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Public opinion is bound to swing around. Well, before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. It's time I owned my family's past. Take responsibility for what my father did. So we can all move forward. Well, that can't be easy. But I'm glad that you're here. Appreciate that. I was half hoping Batman might show up too. Mm. Can't be too. I wouldn't cases mind knowing he was keeping an eye on things here. Not to mention, <laughs> he makes one hell of an impression on people. If Batman isn't here, it's because he's more needed somewhere else. I wouldn't take it personally. <laughs> Good advice when it comes to that guy. I'm ready for you, Commissioner. You know, during times like these, it can feel impossible to hold on to hope. But I have hope. Hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Now, in the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community band together to fight those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Thank you, Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. <laughs> Got line I'm here today to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses. And some of those losses came at the hands of my own father. Or at least as a result of his actions. I would like to take this opportunity to apologize. To tell you how sorry I am for the pain the Wayne family has caused this community. Why are if they my shocked? my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. My family's wealth was built on the suffering of others. I think it's time to repay that debt. Yes. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of its citizens better. And to that end, 
I am ceasing construction on the Wayne Mental Health Facility. Instead, I'll be devoting all my resources to improving the existing Arkham Asylum. Yes. It will be the most advanced mental health treatment facility in the country, in keeping with the vision of its founders. Oh my god, who is that guy? Who is that? What the hell? No justice, no peace in Gotham. Are you serious, bro? Anyways. Clear the area! Get that bastard to lock up! Wow, that's insane. Just minutes ago, Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. He sure does clean up well. Sound out. Thank you so much for watching the last episode of Batman the Telltale series. It has been a wonderful journey to do this series and I've enjoyed every single minute of it. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys next week.